Hi guys, this is Jeff at the Glorious Uncertainty on the last day of the month, 31st of March. But you know what happens tomorrow? Apart from April Fool's Day. But I won't be doing that one, don't worry. Um, the first day of the flat, the Doncaster. And we should be and we should be pleased and we should be proud of the fact we've gone through since December playing in the sand. We didn't go I didn't I stuck to what I said. We didn't go on the jumps. We played in the sand and we proved a profit. Right. I was hoping to bust through a hundred points for March, but it didn't happen, did it? I might just found one too strong, didn't it, really? But I think I think the money was right to, to go with Athmag with the unproven um, other one. Or Herbert Reigns. Just didn't do it for me. But anyway, we wound up 89 points on our account. 89 points up. If you'd have got uh, Walefa at the tens. You were laughing all the way to the bank, weren't you, really? But this is fair and it is square. And it is a yardstick that we all have to um, get somewhere near. If we can get somewhere near these figures, we're turning a profit. We're doing OK. Um, right. Thank you very much for the reaction yesterday to the 23 minute epic. The epic. And the truth, I believe. I believe to be the truths about um, gambling, horse racing, temperament, especially that 400 point bank. <laughs> um, all of the things that are required to do this. Patience as well. Somebody mentioned patience. You have to be patient. Right. So we ended up the month 89 points up on our book, on our account, which was great. Um, and um, I'm looking forward, really looking forward to to the flat starting. So what I'm doing today is there's no bet today. Um, came close with one, but I wasn't trying to preserve the bank. I was just thinking my time really is better employed, sorting out and getting prepped up, ready for tomorrow because the going is going to be soft, heavy. In places at Doncaster, I'm looking forward to that challenge. Um, and, um, yeah, we all move forward. Um, don't forget as well, there are two, there are two things that I said I wouldn't do. And there are reasons, a very good reason for this. Right. First of all, is that I, um, said I wouldn't go on the jumps, which I don't, but I think I did one only one accumulator right at the start which actually won it came in um wasn't much but it was just a place accumulator the other thing um so i stuck on the sand and the other thing was i said i would never write down there free horse racing tips and the reason for that was I decided that I didn't want all and sundry coming here onto this channel with aspirations. I find that those who find us now are from word of mouth um, and for all the right reasons. So we are doing it the right way, I think. Let people come to us slowly. Um, and they don't bring all these hopes and dreams with them. They bring a reality to it, as we've got here, which we were talking about yesterday. Right. Um, I have more blocks to lay today, which I'm going to do that. Uh, I'm prepping up tonight for the flat. Um, I am, as of Sunday, heading back. I've got a big contract. Oh, sorry, that's a lie. I've got the... A provisional meetings and stuff, a big contract in that there London, as we say, up north, uh, London with a U. 
Um, so I will be all next week. It will be from. I'll be in central London, so um, I'll be messaging you from there. It doesn't stop us what we're doing. Um, I'm looking forward to the flat. I really am looking forward to the flat. And like I say, we turned a profit on the sand. And a lot of people hate the sand. They detest it. But we did it. We turned it a profit on the sand. And so, as I've said before, I'm proud about that. Good for us. But tomorrow, the flat, the green stuff, we're back on that. Might be muddy. I don't care. Right. Okay, have a great day. What are you doing? No bet. Cheers. Bye for now. Bye-bye.